Ha ha ha! It's time to create some visual force pages. All right, let's just get right on to it. I'm gonna launch my hands on orgs here, pop, and go to my developer um, trailhead, and open my developer console. So this is how we can create a visual force page. Click on the gear icon here and hit developer console. And I'm going to close my previous codes from the previous trail heads and file new visual force page there. And let's name this one. Hello world. Hello world. Okay, we have a simple hello world, which is blank, right? If I say here, bada bing, bada boom, bada boom, bam, and save it. Now we can preview. It's just gonna say bada bing, bada boom, which is really tiny there, see? So if I make this a bit bigger make it an h1 it's a header so it's an html tag and make that bigger save that and hit preview again Did I hit preview while well, it's in the other window it's still small but now it's bold so that's how you create a visual force page it's pretty simple right let's head back to the trail now so introduction to creating visual force pages so there is a whole bunch of components and tags you can use so how do you know what's available okay what is your Lego pieces? I want to see all the Lego pieces. So if you buy a huge Lego box, contains 1500 pieces or 5000 Lego pieces, you want to see what kind of pieces you have, right? So you can Google Visual Force Reverence Guide there. And you go here. And you can see the tags somewhere over here. Maybe I should click on Apex page sublink there. Here, Apex page. I'm going to click there. And here, this is all the tags that's available. See? For example, if I click on Apex form. What can you do with an Apex forum here? What is it, right? Apex image or any other tags you can use. This is the available tags there. You have a lot of them, right? So we are not even going to touch a tiny percent of this available tags. We're just going, go, going to go through the examples that is provided by Trailhead. Okay, let's start uh, and move on. So we have tested the hello world with bada bing, bada boom. And then, okay, so you can also see it from a JavaScript console. So I'm gonna copy this code here and go to my main page. So if you're on Google Chrome um, and command option J to open the console, and then I'm going to paste the code that we just copied from the trailhead there, see? And just hit enter. Oops, oh yeah, I need to change the to hello world here, right? Hello world and hit enter. There, you can see bada bing, bada boom, right? 
So that's another way to see it. I'm going to close this now and just refresh it. So it's going to go back to where it was. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay. So now we can add some other stuff. Basically, you already get it, right? So if you added the code, it will also display on the Visual Force page. So also when you're coding, there is a suggestion that will be prompted to you. For example, if I'm going to here and there, the suggestion box there, like cache through. So you can see what's the available option that you can use by just typing a space after the tag, right? Which we just see. Okay, what else? Um, and then let's go on. So let's see what else is going to um, happen when we add a page block tag and then there's a page block section there. So you can see how it's going to be styled. All right, I'm just going to copy and paste that and save that. Flip back to my bada bing bada boom here and refla refresh. See, that's that's better, right? I'm gonna I'm gonna zoom in a bit, zoom in, and zoom in so you can see a block title, hello world, a block title, a section title. I am three components deep. So this is the hello world. This is the block title. This is the title of the block title, right? My awesome zone training, right? If I change that, you will see here, if I refresh this guy, it's going to change to my, uh, my awesome Sonar.io training. So that's how you style and block the Visual Force page, the basic ones. Okay, let's move on here. Let's copy this one and see how it's going to look like. Boom, save. And then if I flip back to my Hello World page, see, it's going to style it out like this. Pretty cool, right? You can collapse it like that. Yeah. All right. So we are still doing basic stuff here. And as we go, it will get more fun. All right. So tell me more. What else can we do? Yeah, there is um, page block, page block section, which we see upstairs. There's buttons as well, and there's so much more. See, if you go to the um, developer reference here, you can see all kinds of stuff. You can repeat from data sources. You can do chatter functions as well, display chatters. And there's just so much, okay? We won't be even touching a, a lot of this through the trailhead, but feel free to reference to this page as you develop your own application. So when we're done with developer beginner, we will do real world applications together. Once that can be used for real, all right? And it's gonna be so fun. So much fun. Let's go back here. I think we are done with the examples, simple examples. And now we are going to do the visual force hands on challenge, but I'm going to separate uh, those in the next video. So I'll see you on the next video. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce app exchange and do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word, watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.